लेसन नंबर सिक्स मेजरमेंट ऑफ फिजिकल क्वांटिटीज फिजिकल क्वांटिटी इन द डे टू डे लाइफ वी मेजर मेनी थिंग्स सच एज वेट ऑफ फ्रूट्स वेजिटेबल्स फूड ग्रेन टेम्परेचर ऑफ द बॉडी और सम लिक्विड वॉल्यूम्स ऑफ लिक्विड डेंसिटी ऑफ वेरियस सब्सटेंसेस द स्पीड ऑफ वेहीकल्स एक्सेट्रा क्वांटिटीज सच एज मास वेट डिस्टेंस स्पीड टेम्परेचर वॉल्यूम आर कॉल्ड फिजिकल क्वांटिटीज अ वैल्यू एन ए यूनिट आर यूज टू एक्सप्रेस द मैग्नेट्यूड ऑफ द फिजिकल क्वांटिटी फॉर एग्जाम्पल स्वराली वॉक्स टू किलोमीटर्स एवरी डे इन दिस एग्जाम्पल टू इज द वैल्यू एंड किलोमीटर इज द यूनिट यूज टू एक्सप्रेस द मैग्नेट्यूड ऑफ द डिस्टेंस विच इज द फिजिकल क्वांटिटी मास The amount of matter present in the substance is called mass. Matter has a natural tendency to resist a change in its state, which is called inertia. Mass is the qualitative measure of the inertia of an object. The larger the mass, the greater is the inertia. Mass is a scalar quantity. It does not change from place to place anywhere in the world the quantities mass and weight are however different gram and kilogram are the units of mass when we use the two pan common balance in the shop we compare two masses weight what we measure in grams kilograms is mass and not weight the gravitational force that acts on this mass is called its weight the gravitational force by which the earth attracts an object towards its center is called the weight of an object therefore weight is a vector quantity it is different at different places on the earth in everyday affairs we measure many different physical quantities as these physical quantities are different from each other a specific unit is used to measure each quantity therefore different units are used while measuring different quantities there are many physical quantities but a majority of them are related to each other for example you have learned that quantity speed is the ratio of the quantities distance and time fundamental quantities it is enough to select a few out of the many quantities and standardize their units you can see from the above examples that units of the quantities length and time need to be standardized such quantities are called fundamental quantities and their units are called standard units of course a standard fundamental unit must be available to all and it must not be variable international system of units an international system of units based on seven fundamental units called the system international into bracket si is currently used all over the world it is also called the metric system the names and symbols of the units of the fundamental quantities length time and mass in this system are given in the following table quantity name of the unit symbol of the unit length meter m mass kilogram kg time second s importance of accurate measurement how accurate a measurement must be depends upon its purpose accordingly an appropriate device has to be used for the measurement measurement of substances that are precious of a great importance and used in very small quantities is done meticulously and accurately due to advancements in technology devices that measure very small magnitudes of quantities like distance mass time and temperature are available now For example distance and time in connection with very important sports competitions mass of gold body temperature etc major causes of errors in measurement 
1. Not using the appropriate device. 2. Not using the device properly. Make a list of all possible errors other than these. Do you really get many liters of petrol as a petrol pump indicates? To ensure this, it is necessary to check it with against a standard measure from time to time. This is called standardization. Similarly, it is necessary to standardize the weight and measures used in the market.